They're oh, both, they're filthy. Yeah. They're both like the same color as her, almost. A little darker though. And uh, let's go to the barn with them and we'll be able to tell them apart and clean them up. Of course, Shirley's here with her. Shirley had to help grab the babies. Alrighty, y'all. So, for those y'all, huh? Okay. We're gonna go to one of the stalls. Oh, Come on, babies. Come on. Come on, man. Come on, <laughs> is, Shir on is Shirley gonna come, come with on, her, Shirley. really? Come on, we're gonna go to the stall. Come on, Shirley. <laughs> Now this is what happened whenever you have a skittish goat that just had babies because she wants to come and take care of the babies, but she also doesn't want to leave the yard. So this is a bit of a dilemma for her. Come on, Laverne. They're your babies. You have to overcome your fear. You have to overcome your fear of the outside world. We got littles running all over the place. Oh man, what happened over here? Okay. What are you about? Yeah. What are you about? Oh, I don't, I just, I just came out here because they said Laverne had babies, so I have nothing to do with this. It's a long story. <laughs> Let's take, put the baby in a stall. Okay. We'll they go. covered in mud and. Okay, so we got to wipe them up. <laughs> they look cute. Really? Just stop. They are very healthy. They're huge. They are very, very healthy babies. And I mean, they're big. Identical. That whole scream gene thing, that's like word for word what one of us said whenever Laverne was born. Yeah, I, we got a lot to do. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen. Let's make a plan. Jamie will get a towel to wipe off the babies. I will go catch Shirley. I can walk her over here. Laverne will follow. Laverne will sh follow uh, Shirley. And then we'll put them oh, all wow. together. <laughs> Turn yeah. <laughs> uh, the duties of farm life, y'all. Uh, it's just ridiculous how you... Hey, Maggie, come here. Pull her in, Nellie. Pull her in. Pull her all the way in. Laverne will follow. All the way in, Ellie. All right, there we go. Oh, Man, guys, that was a fiasco. I'm just still, I feel like every video I'm in awe about something. This time, I'm in awe about two things. Number one, I'm in awe about how strong the scream gene is in this lineage. These babies get the scream gene from their mama, Laverne. I'm gonna show you on the screen. Um, I'm gonna show you how much of a screamer Laverne was when she was a baby. And then where did Laverne get it from? She got it from her mama, from Shirley. Shirley was probably the granddaddy or grandmommy of them all as far as screamers go. You've not heard a goat scream until you heard this little girl scream. <laughs> Is that all you got, baby? Oh, freckle. I love her. <laughs> That's a cute little scream. So pretty. Stop, Freckles. I'm just loving her. Look at that. All right. Here. Go back to mama. <laughs> but it's just crazy, like, how strong the genes are for certain things like that. This is just, uh, right here, you have a stall full of screamers. That's the best way that I can put it, guys. It's just crazy. That's number one. And then number two is just... I guess how spoiled Laverne is. We love how close-knit the mommy and daughter are right here between Shirley and Laverne. We love they can go everywhere together. And we love that they're so close that Shirley could be with her whenever she had her babies. I feel like I'm having to scream to talk over these babies. No one's even holding them and they're still screaming at the top of their lungs. I'm going to lose my voice trying to talk over these babies right here. This is crazy. But... All in all though, these babies look really healthy. I'm gonna get low. These babies, 
I mean, Laverne's always been really healthy. Whenever a goat is a little bit chunky, you, you know that they've been eating good and they have some weight on them. And Laverne, even before she was pregnant, has always been pretty chunky. She's been a big girl. I even would say big girls don't cry whenever Laverne was a baby. So Laverne's always been big and these babies look pretty big too. So even despite how the nuisance of them screaming maybe, uh, I do gotta say they are really healthy. And so we are happy about that. Laverne does and surely they have very healthy genes it appears. So Freckles, Shirley's mom, um, I don't know if y'all know the story of Freckles. I made a video about it around a year ago, but basically long story short, uh, one day there was a goat dropped off at our house and that was Freckles and we didn't know it, but she was pregnant. And so after we had her for a little bit, she ended up having a baby and that baby was Shirley. And so Shirley was the first screamer, the grandma screamer of this crew. And it makes me wonder if Freckles, whenever she was a baby, was a screamer too. If Freckles was the great grandma of the screaming lineage here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. It's just crazy stuff altogether. Guys, that, I think the craziest thing of this all to me is how even in the midst of pregnancy, Laverne and Shirley never ceased to be by each other's side the whole time. So much so that we had to bring Shirley in here to get Laverne to follow because Laverne's kind of untamed and unfriendly. And like my dad was saying, that's why you want to bottle feed your babies because if you don't, they'll end up like Laverne and you'll have to do what we just did. And so let that be a warning to you all and let that be a testament to why you need to bottle feed your babies, okay? <laughs> Oh, so it can be a little bit easier for y'all than what you just witnessed us do. I heard Journey somewhere. All right. I lost my train of thought because I heard Journey. Journey has an effect on me like that. Journey always makes me lose my train of thought when I hear Journey. Distracting me from my video, Journey. Journey, do you want to be the baby again? I think Journey wants to be the baby again. Oh no, Journey, not, this, means them, this means that you're fourth in rank now. That means that there's been Pebbles' babies, uh, Sophia's babies, and now Laverne's baby. So Pebbles is fourth in line now as far as the babies go. So her jealousy is just going to grow by the day. Oh man. Hey baby, what's up? What's up little baby? Man, imagine... I'm sure some of you moms out there who have given birth before have had your mother or the grandma of the new babies to help you take care of them. I remember that whenever I was born, my grandma helped me, helped my mom take care of me too. And so that's probably how Laverne and Shirley feel right now. Probably makes it a lot easier whenever you have a grandma to help you take care of the workload. You know what I mean? And so that's a blessing for sure. You love to see it. Alrighty guys, this video is kind of dragging. The last thing I'm going to show y'all is how cool it is just to have a little side-by-side -side nursery right here. You have Sophia and her babies in this stall. And then you have Shirt, you have Laverne and her babies and her mom with her in this stall. Shirley, you got grandma duties. Shirley, you got grandma duties. But no, look at this right here. A little side-by-side -side nursery here. Isn't that the coolest thing? I think it's awesome. <laughs> oh, there's a baby. That's where the third baby was. I was looking for the third baby, but I see it in the bucket right there. <laughs> look. Wait. Yeah, look. There's two babies in that one bucket, and then the third baby's in the very far bucket right there. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Alrighty guys, that's a wrap for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Be sure to let me know in the comments what kind of stuff you want to see. Hope you have a great day. And as I always say, your boy Ellie out.